Hello, my beautiful Capricorns. Welcome to your August readings. August energies, loves. Who is coming towards you? What's on the way towards you this particular month? Let's see, darlings. As always, as always, know these are general energies. My resonate strongly with you my not as much let's see loves towards my capricorns what's heading your way and how those energies are we have a four of cups we have a six of pentacles a hierophant a three of swords and a nine of cups Okay, and of course we have a tower moment. Why is telling me here that somebody here doesn't want to do or has to do with anyone or some some particular person? It's like somebody here just feel like I I don't want to have to deal with this person any longer. It's kind of like everything somebody here wants to change. For some of you, you might be in a situation that you try to fix or work for a while, but now you just, just feel like it's better just to change it than to keep it or to fix it. Something here feels like can't be fixed or you don't want to invest any energy to fix it. We have a judgment, we have a queen of cups. For some of you, there's a water sign over here, six of swords and the emperor. Even someone, it's kind of look at here, someone here wants to work things out, someone here just wants to move on with their own life. Which one is you doesn't necessarily mean here, but for some of you, there is a person here who definitely want to work things out with you or want another chance i also see here there is a ego energy here that this doesn't serve me in any better or in any way i'd rather move on than stay so it's a big turnout of a situation here for some of you capricorns but let's see here who is this queen of cups Nine of Pentacles. Okay. So for some of you, if you wanted something before, now you don't. But this person does want. So it's kind of a, when when I wanted, they did not. Now it's my turn. So it's kind of we take turns. And now this person wants to be with you or wants to fix things with you. And work things out. Or they, they, they are willing to, to work things out with you. For some of you, you, you kind of like has certain um, standards here or certain things that you want to follow. It's like, if we work this situation, it's my way. Otherwise, it's not working. I'm feeling here this person even, even this way is willing to accept just to be around. For some of you, this is a family situation. For others of you, it's a money situation. But I, I pick up a very strong family energy. Why you are in the Six of Swords here, loves? Yeah, you, you kind of want something else. For others of you, it's a new life. For others of you, it's a whole new person. It is a new life or it's a new person. The, um, the full moon in Aquarius will be very, very strong for some Capricorns. And you know, uh, full moon in Aquarius is, I believe it's August 19th. So by the 19th, that's the time. Yeah. Why you are... For some of you, it's like, I forgive this person, but I'm not forgetting. It's more likely whoever here comes for forgiveness, whoever here comes back to you, it's more likely, yes, I forgive them, but I'm not going to stop from my way. Six of Wands. 
I know what they want, but I know what I want more. For some of you, you, you needed to move forward with your life. So someone to come back and work things out with you. It's like you needed to make some uh, adjustments or some actions to take for them to come back or want to be back. You you are not quite sure, but it's is the thing here for some of you. You really wanted someone, but you you didn't know how to bring them or kind of attract them back or be with them. But now once you move forward, you you're not sure if you really want this person anymore. It's it's quite ironic here for some of you because you. You kind of I don't know if I if I want to be around you any longer because that was such a long time for you to make a decision or for us to work things out. For some of you, you could be working on a situation here for more than three years, but you know sometimes it's kind of uh, we want something so bad. And at one point we we don't want anymore. But I feel here the universe brings you this person for for you to see for yourself what you need, what you want, and what you don't. Yeah, because for some of you you realize that you are better friends than family, or certain things here works more in a friendship than in a love ship. Because I feel here that you have a history with this person. Absolutely. Yeah, certain things here are ending. Absolutely, there's a chapter here that ends. For some of you, you are ending a marriage here. But you, you're going to stay friends. It's kind of, we are friends, not enemies. But somebody here needed to realize that the hard way or after they, they needed to do a lot of work. It's kind of a, a happy, a happy ending energy here, a final, which is happy. But not as happy as you would like to be at one point. It's like why why we should suffer so long to to get at the end this. But I feel here as the spirit says, you supposed to learn a lesson. And that lesson you could not learn unless this situation were here this way. What else comes in? King of Wands, Page of Wands. Ten of Swords, Three of Wands, and Death. And then we have the Justice. For... For some of you, yes, you... You might take a break or you might take a mini vacation for a few days just to rest because I see here there's some Capricorns here very tired or got tired after such a long time so it's kind of a few days off out from the world or from the the crowd just kind of a replenish energy for some of you, whatever here you go, either you go a few days or a week or whatever you go just to relax, you might meet someone special at that time. I don't feel you very much into anything new or that person especially, but I feel here will uh, will spark you something in you. Definitely. You, you might feel here that the, there's definitely love after, um, after hurt. Wow. 
Wow. Yeah, deep down inside you will know that certain things here starts to, to get to normal or get better. Or you know you, you can love again. You can see new people or be around other people without feeling, you know, on the defense or in the um, victim mentality or this is not for me or this is to hurt me. It's just kind of going with the flow. That is the beauty of taking a break, loves. What advice we have for you? Five of Pentacles, Two of Wands, Six of Cups. The advice is even the easy, even the hard way, when it's coming the time, you will make the best decision for you. For many of you, you are definitely on a new venture, on a new path. You, you decide to move to a new path or towards something new. For others of you, finally, you are ending a situation that definitely brought you a lot of sadness. What also is telling me here, Capricorns, this month you are going to balance a lot of things, including relationships with loved ones balancing things in your career, in your finances. And really, you are going to focus on getting things into a better energy. Even though some of them you want to, other of them you don't. It's kind of getting to normal, to a new normal. Like things you probably didn't want to before, now you are going to do them easier. If you've been holding on on finances or not doing this because I don't have enough, now you'll find different ways how you can do things in a much more easy way. And for some of you, if you didn't take care of you or, or you didn't have time to, to do things for you, you are going to do more or you'll have more time for yourself. So yes, after the, um, the hurricane comes the sun or after the hardships comes better times and indeed this is happening for you, loves. But I feel here there is a specific person here you could deal and was quite hard to to make that work in some kind of way but as, but as you see nothing is impossible love and like capricorns that's what i got for you for what's coming in for you this month i hope this connects you in a certain way or another and i'll see you next time bye for now